week's vlog. Um, thanks for clicking on this video, by the way. I'm Sophie, if you're new here, Sophie Society, hi. So today is Tuesday, and if you guys don't know, my mom is a school teacher, and y'all know school's about to start, which I'm still confused about this whole virus thing, whatever. Anyway, so I'm going with her today to her classroom so she can get her classroom together for school to start, I guess. Um, I knew she left the keys in the car. Good thing we live in a good neighborhood because she always leaving these keys in the car. Somebody going to steal this car one day. I got them. Anyways, so do you guys like these two braids? My hair was already straight, so I asked my mom to braid my hair because I don't know how to braid. Yes, I'm a black girl that don't know how to braid. Lord, help me. But, um, yeah, so... That's what we're about to do right now. I think we're about to actually go, hopefully, to Chick-fil-A to get something to eat real quick. Because I want a little salad, a little cob salad. Um, I've got a lime ranch dressing. And, yeah, not really doing much else. So, I'm just going to vlog throughout the day. Oh, hey, guys. Uh, a little bit later. I'm just sitting in the car right now. My mom ran into the store, so I'm eating my Chick-fil-A salad. Anyways, I wanted to talk to you guys because, well, I don't know who's watching this channel, but I want to do a story time, actually, a sit-down video. Y'all, I'm just going through a dilemma right now, and it's so crazy, as y'all, well, if you go back and look at a few of my old videos, and you'll see that I recently graduated from college. While in college... Basically what I'm saying is, I feel like right now my life is a big question mark. I don't have a job in my field at all. I don't have a job at all right now. Um, and let alone one in my field, which is media, communications, journalism. So, uh, I just feel like, what the heck am I doing? I just feel like I am I just wasted five years of my life in college. I don't have a job. I live in a place where it's a small city. So, there aren't that many opportunities when it comes down to the media world here. This is more of a traditional city, like teaching, nursing, I don't know restaurants but as far as like media it ain't popping here i don't know what to do guys i'm just i feel like my life is in limbo right now i'm 24 i'll be 25 in um february y'all know i have a podcast which you can click right here boop um i have a podcast with my sister and that i would love for that to get up off the ground um because that is something that i do want to do because it's basic it's media it's just it's me creating my own show versus me trying to work for someone show who's already established like cbs nbc or something like that i just decided to create one with creating things of course it takes time it takes dedication it takes patience i'm here for that but in the meantime and in between time i need some money but i don't know what to do do i go get another part-time job until my career um is where i want it to be or do I just remain broke? <laughs> because I feel a ways about working. I don't know. I guess I feel weird like now having a degree. Like before I had the degree, of course, like having part-time jobs and all that stuff, it's, you know, it's normal. But now that I have a degree, like I have a degree. Why am I working at Zaxby's? I don't work at Zaxby's, but I'm just saying, like, why am I doing that when I have a degree? What was the point? Which is uh, the issue in uh, America, period. Oversaturated market. It's not enough jobs, all that stuff. I don't know y'all but if you are a recent college grad and you're going through what i'm going through comment down below because i know there are some people in college or recently graduated and they have their dream job or they got an internship while they were in college and that turned into a job once they graduated which was my hopes and dreams but that didn't turn out for me and then this whole covid thing is to make it any better uh, i don't know what i just feel like a bum I just feel like, I don't know, I just feel so unstable. Is that a word? Unstable. Unstable right now in my life. Hey, y'all. It's the next morning. I look a mess, but that's okay. Um, I am up. I was about to say up early. Girl, it's 1230. I just woke up. That's the life when you have nothing to do. Anyways. I got a iced coffee from Ducky Donuts because I plan to be productive today. I'm filming a YouTube video and I'm gonna clean my room. And I also got a little sandwich I'm gonna show y'all. I don't really eat their food at Dunkin' Donuts, but I just wanted something to eat um, so I can take my medicine. I've been diagnosed with PCOS, which is polycystic 
ovary syndrome so anyways anyways um this is what it is just a bacon egg and cheese croissant sandwich croissant sandwich By my side, you feel me? Can't do nothing without him. Won't do nothing without him. And Nipsey, guys, we are at Pepco. Nipsey's about to get groomed. Groomed. Nipsey, look. Huh? Ah. Hello, Nipsey. You're about to get groomed. So let's see what we're talking about. So today is Friday and I'm actually about to head out and run a few errands or whatever. But I'm going to change my purses from this, from Target, and then just into this little Steve Madden little book bag thing. Because I have a lot of stuff in here and I just need a bag. Okay, this is a purse. This is a bag. So yeah, I'm just going to change my purse real quick. Cha wallet, sunglasses. Couple of pins, some lotion, Ooh, my medicine, uh, well, tissue. These are gift cards that I still have not used all the way from Christmas. Um, Q tips, these are nail filers, body spray, mask, another thing of lotion. Here's crunchy. Tylenol, I get headaches all the time, so Tylenol. Another hair tie. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Another hair tie and an end piece. What are these called? Is it called an end piece, a square, the head? I don't know what this is called, but whatever. And I forgot about my Wendy's coupons. Are these expired? Ooh, Target gift card. And then this little pouch, which I love. It's really convenient. My mom got it for me. In this pouch, in this pouch contains a nail filer, a mini nail clipper, a lip gloss, body pins, a nail clear nail polish coat, rubber bands, a hair tie, a uh, makeup remote. Rem Makeup remover wipe, nail polish remover wipe, and I think that's it. I love this. It comes in handy. It's mini. There's another mini item. Hello! Hello! Y'all want to see something cool? Hello! it all the time oh hand sanitizer how could I forget <laughs> lip gloss well yeah oh I've been looking for these my bamboo earrings feminista feminist I could put these on today these are cute and another lip balm aquaphor best lip balm ever who still wears Carmax I don't know oh another pair of earrings some hoops Ooh, we a little bit of change. I think that. Let me see. Oh, and my headphones. No, I do not have AirPods yet, but I still have these. and I'm on my way to the park today it's August 1st and for the one billionth time in my life I am going to I'm going on a weight loss journey okay a fitness journey a health journey I've tried to lose weight so many times in my adult life I always start and stop but for real for real now I'm not playing I'm tired literally so Today is day one, it's August 1st. Um, normally I would be like, oh, I'm gonna start on a Monday. But August 1st is 
a new month and um, it lands on a Saturday. So that's what I'm doing. Right now I am on my way to one of the parks here in town, a little walking trail or whatever, and I'm gonna go walking. I'm thinking we're just gonna walk uh, like three miles. I've gotten together an entire like workout plan, meal plan that I did myself. So I'll get more in details in that actually on my other video because I'm going to be having a whole weight loss series. So it'll be vlog style, but it'll be like more in depth details about what, you know, I'm doing to lose weight and all that jazz. So yeah, today's day one. Yeah, guys, wish me luck because I've tried to lose weight so many times that I just start, I'll be going strong for like a month. And then after that, it's a wrap, y'all. And then, if y'all don't know, I'm about to turn 25, February 2nd. That's six months from now. Let me just say, I'm trying to be right. You feel me? Because 25, like that's so dramatic but like another chapter of life I want to be my best self like I went through half of my 20s and some of my teens being overweight and saying oh I'm gonna you know lose weight I want to now is the time to actually do it so I'm gonna stop talking y'all heads off before I run off the road and then I'll be back <laughs> Hey guys, it's pretty dark, but I want to show you guys that I am at a hotel. We we are in Montgomery, Alabama. Um, this is our hotel room. Nothing mage, but it's actually like the hotel was pretty nice. So yeah, we are here in Montgomery. Peep the shirt. Who's on it? Okay. <laughs> forever president and here we are yeah so um it's sunday night and i'm actually about to get ready to edit this vlog okay guys since i am just stuck in a hotel room until we leave in the morning um i thought i would wash my face with you guys so First thing that I always do is wash my hands because yeah. it's essential. Okay, and this is a little pouch thingy here that I just have a couple of my travel size items. So, okay, so the first thing I'm doing is taking off my makeup and I'm using the Neutrogena makeup removal wipes are the best. Since, like I said, travel size, 
This is what I'm using, which is, it's a Pixie Glow Tonic. This is pretty popular and yeah. So, um, I'm going to take some of Y'all see how small this is. I literally just knocked it over. Look, literally dripping. Now it's literally like a drop left. Hey, I can't have nothing in life. This is a bad angle. Look at my head, look how you're chicken head. But if you saw my last video, which should be right here, then you'll know I cut my hair. So. Make sure you go look at that. But I'm about to go in with my moisturizer, which is the Ula Ule Ula Ule Ule Henrik Henrik Ule Henriksen moisturizer, which you can't really see, but it's a nighttime moisturizer, and it's just a little bit left. And so I'm just going to take. is done this is what we're looking like not too bad a few imperfections but it's life make sure you guys hit that subscribe button please and give this video a thumbs up and be on the lookout for my next video next week and uh yeah hit that subscribe button for real stop lying i know what you're saying see you guys in the next one